Okay, we started to pull some cards and uh, we'll look and see what they have to say. So the, the topic is about um, emerging. Okay, about emerging, coming out the other side. And this is the, uh, it's about government, truth, keys, um, in going forward, we need to be strong and uh, to evolve, uh, evolve, because now we have, at, above it is, is some indecision when it comes to Trump and these, uh, the Trump's, you know, Wish fulfilling card and Trump. It looks like um, at the moment there's some indecision. You know, now these repugly uglies know something's wrong, but they're not willing to stand up. Okay, they're they're not willing. The indecision behind the things when they're not seen. They're oh my God, you know. But, uh, you know, in front of the scenes, they're going to, you know, keep him in office. Okay. But when this is over, it's saying we're going to emerge. We're going to evolve. It's going to be stronger. We're going to have more, better keys, better rules and things when it comes to government. And, uh, you know, what's, uh, what's honest and correct. Okay. So we're going to come out the other side uh, better than what we are now. We're going to evolve and make some changes, okay? So continue to be strong. Continue to be strong. So let's see what we have next. Next, we have what is this resting mode? What is this? You get some other cards and see exactly what this is saying. Publicity. Changing to these cards. Okay, what? What about publicity? Is this in you know having armor and just wait, wait for it? Okay. I feel like this one is the publicity that there's going to be some really nasty stuff maybe with Trump coming out. Starting opportunity. Yeah, going forth strongly when it comes to publicity. Okay. So I think this is about uh, that probably Trump and the Repugly Uglies are going to put out some really nasty uh, publicity. Or this could also be the other way around. It could be, even though Trump feels insulated in his armor, there's daggers above him just waiting to fall. Publicity is going to come out. Uh, again, someone's going to take the opportunity. Hey, 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 it's okay. They can walk their dog. No, they can, they can be here. They live here. It's okay. Really? Really, you two? He 
says, well, I don't like them in my space. <coughs> okay, all right, I hear you. Could you stop now? Hey, grousing. No grousing. <coughs> yeah, you got to get the last wolf in, don't you? So I think this is just, you know, even though Trump is feeling insulated and everything now, more publicity stuff is going to come out. Somebody's going to take the opportunity. Will you quit? Quit, 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 quit. Come over here. Quit, 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 quit. Quit barking him. Oh, you too. You want to come up here so you can bark too? Troublemakers. <laughs> So I th somebody's going to come forward about the money again. They're going to talk, and it's going to be strong, okay? And uh, the publicity, they're not going to be able to keep this quiet, okay? He's not going to be able to keep this quiet. It's going to come forward, okay? Let's see what else we have. What else is next? Pull from the bottom. Okay. Working on what's being worked on. What's being worked on? It's going to be quarreling again. We know there's going to be division coming up for sure. When we get another whistleblower coming forward and speaking out. And they're still doing more investigations as to all the stuff that he's been involved with. That they're trying to, to you know, just sail, sail through. But... You know, it's not going to be easy. They've got all these things just waiting there to be looked at. Okay. Now, the Repugly Uglies are not going to be happy with this. Okay. Uh, again, they're going to try to make it seem that it's unlawful what's being done. Okay. But uh, Democrats are going to keep working on what they need to work on to unmask all the things that he's been involved with. Okay. To continue to unmask all the things that they've been involved with. Yeah. The thefts. When it comes to the thefts, let's see what we have going. What about when it comes to thefts? Detachment. spin yeah when it comes to Trump's family so they're going to have these investigations into the things that Trump's family has been doing okay um, yeah and so There are those higher up, like Trump and stuff, that's going to be trying to be in denial of it. Detachment, you know, don't look at that, don't look at that. Uh, and they're going to try to put some spin on it for the things that he has done. And he's been um, basically lying about, okay? <laughs> it's basically the lies. 
when it comes to the things that the uh, Trump family has gotten away with or t attempted to get away with. And so I think this is like Barr <clears throat> trying to detach from it. Okay, Barr may be trying to detach from that once all that stuff starts coming out. What do we have next? The merchant. What about the merchant? Is this the people's payoffs? The ones that are in league with him? Or is this Trump himself? Or is it a wish fulfilling card? What is it? Principle. Okay. Principle. So it's more about their unethical, okay, the unethical things they've been doing, principles. What? There's no one out there now. Quit grousing. Okay, there are those that don't want to see, uh, trying to block it. Yeah, Republican Party is going to try to block it. Not see. Na 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 na. Okay. <laughs> or it could just be the Republican Party themselves that have been, you know, sold their ethics down the river. Could be that too. But uh, they they've taken all these payoffs, and so more is going to be coming out about that as well. They've sold out. <clears throat> They've sold out. It's like, I don't see, I don't know, I don't, you know, blocking everything. Lost their principles for, for the money. Okay. So more is going to come out on that the world stage. What about the world stage? What about the world stage? So don't forget this reading is about emerging. So this is stuff that's going to be coming forward. More of these types of things. The world. The affair. So who they've been caught up with, okay? It's about who Trump and the Republic uglies have been caught up with in the world. Chariot. Moving forward into a defensive position. So they're going to try to defend their actions when it comes to uh, the people that they're engaging in behind the scenes. They're going to try to defend their actions. Whether it's Putin or Ukrainians or whatever, or, or the Saudis that they sold out to. Okay, they're going to go forward. More is going to come out about their dealings on the world stage, and he's going to become more defensive. Of course. What a surprise. King of Cups. <clears throat> Control. Pain 
in full end. Okay. So I would say King of Cups and the Queen of Wands. I would say maybe that is a shift, shift in Pelosi controlling this demise, okay, this demise. So they're going to continue to control this narrative, putting this stuff out there, okay, to, to put an end to Trump's reign of terror that he's been doing. Empress, our value system, the United States value system. Innovation. Justice. Justice. Okay. So it looks like maybe there's going to be some sort of a shift when it comes to justice departments and our valuation systems uh, when it comes to these these guys in power yeah I'm feeling like it's going to be a shift in the court systems okay that we want to keep our foundation of our values okay innovation making some changes with the uh, court system you know, they've, he's tried to get all these Federalists in. Okay. But I think that, you know, when, when Trump is out, that we're going to hold to our values and change some of that. Devil. What about the devil? What about the devil? Versatility. Can't walk on your feet, you walk on your hands. What is this? It looks like it's got the Star of David up there. What do we have going with this underneath of it? Payoffs? Payoffs that are going to be uncovered? Ah, versatile. He'll, he'll sell out to anyone going to come forward that he he's you know he doesn't hold his values he'll sell out to anyone and there's more things that we we need to uncover that haven't been seen yet okay yeah trump would sell his mother if he could if he could get a dollar and a half for her, he'd sell her. Okay? Got no loyalties anywhere. 
So I think behind the scenes, we're going to see more things are going to be uncovered as to some dirty uh, backdoor dealings that Trump has been putting into place or tried to put into place. Okay. Queen of Rods. Is this Pelosi? What about a Queen of Rods? What about Pelosi? Idealism. I can see that. Pelosi's very idealistic. She holds to the values and wants to continue to keep those things intact. I still think Pelosi would make a good president. It's too bad she's not running. She's idealistic. She's smart. Okay. The tower. The tower. Okay. The truth. So I think that... Uh, this tower. I think this is the big shakeup that's going to come. Tower moment for whom? <clears throat> I think this has to do with Russia. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, I think the tower moment has to do with Trump. Some payoffs and some things with Trump and the uh, Republican uglies that are taking payoffs from Russia, Russian oligarchs. It's going to be a tower moment. You know, they're not done with these investigations. They're going full forward with that because they have the idealism of our country, what it should be and what it shouldn't be. And if they're doing traitorous actions, okay, um, they're going to continue to look into it and uncover and unmask this stuff that's going on. Okay. It's coming. Yeah, Pelosi was not happy last night. Did you see her? She took his speech and tore it up because it was all crap, bluster. Unfortunately, there are those that listen to it and buy into his nonsense. All his fake statistics and things that, you know, everybody's got it so much better since he came into office. Nonsense. Okay, nonsense. Okay, what does it say about that? Emerging. What is it that's being... Isolation. What's coming is isolation. It's being worked on. Isolating Trump. Okay. What's coming is, I think that this is referring to the Republicans are going to pull back from Trump. He's going to become very isolated when this stuff starts coming out. How, you know, how they've uh, all been taking payoffs, that he's uh, behind the scenes, he's willing to sell out the U.S., um, him and his family. More is going to come out about the things they've been engaging in. Again, the whistleblower is going to come forward talking about monies. Another big bombshell. Um, we're going to, you know, again, they're going to try to be in denial about it. Maybe Barr. 
the justice, the denial. But it's not going to work this time to put the spin on it. Okay, it's not going to work this time to put the spin on it. So that denial, forget it, it's not going to happen. And I think that more of the Republicans are going to be pulled into this and, and be unmasked for also uh, taking these payoffs. You know, the money that was underneath the NRA came from Russia, some of that. Okay, so I think more of this is going to come out as well. We're going to emerge stronger, and they're going to take some actions, I think, against the Justice Department when it comes to, to those types of things. So maybe some action will be coming down the pike for Bill Barr as well, and maybe even Trump's lawyers that he had, um, Secolo and, and Scipioli. Scipioli, is that his name, Scipioli? Maybe there will be some things coming down the pike for them as well. But something more is going to come out from uh, justice. So that's what I'm getting today. You know, we're going to have more strength. We're going to evolve when we get to the end of this. Okay. So again, um, hold tight because we are in a pattern of evolution with this. Um, and when you're in a pattern of evolution, sometimes there's going to be breakdown, there's going to be upheavals. You know, all of that stuff comes first before the things shift. It's darkest before the dawn. So again, don't be surprised with what you're seeing, but uh, yeah, and I think most of the readers are seeing the same thing. The readers, and then there was another person I watched last night, can't remember his name. He was interesting, though. He draws these pictures, and I don't know if he, he mentally sees a picture and draws it, or he just, like, unconsciously draws it, connects with the energy, and then a picture just emerges. And then he interprets it. He's a guy from England. And same thing. So some, he's, he's basically saying the same thing. Some big bombshell's going to come out, and there'll be some uh, walking away. Okay. Oh, he was interesting, too. He was saying that Bernie is not going to make it, that it looks like the one that's going to emerge a little later, and the thing is Warren. Um, so we'll have to see uh, where he's at on this. He thinks there's going to be some big blow-up, I think he said, with Biden as well. And uh, what else was it? Oh, I don't remember all of it, but it was it was interesting. He definitely has a different way of doing it. Each one of us have a different way of doing it, you know. And uh, he keys into energy um, and then is able to get visions of uh, pictures or diagrams that he can interpret. So again, everyone is different. Sometimes you have like, uh, for here, like when I was working with um, the Amelia Earhart and the, those other readings, it's like you could feel it as uh, you don't hear actual words, but it's more of you can, let's say, it's like a feeling. It's like it's impressed. It's, uh, it's on the verge of hearing something, but it's impressed on you what it is through emotion, through uh, these subtle things. Um, may have a flash all of a sudden of something or uh, 
yeah, it's hard to explain it because it's not really in the normal senses as to actually auditory hear it. You, it's more on a feeling level where you are impressed and it's uh, in the middle of it, it's kind of changing your emotions, okay? So it's a feeling like, you know, when you're linked in with that energy, it has a shift in your emotion as they are impressing something on you, to you. Okay, that's the best way I can explain what it feels like or how it's happening. Now, I guess some people are auditory. They can hear the actual voice, okay? I'm not hearing the voice. I'm, it, although with Burton, I did hear a couple little blips, you know. It, <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, most often it's more feeling like this impressing on you what it is and you're feeling through sort of their emotion and uh, their, their mind. It's kind of a linking up with that. Um, that's the best way I can describe it, okay? Uh, so anyway, I'm gonna leave this here. Uh, let me know if you've enjoyed the reading. All of these for, are for entertainment purposes. So anyway, thank you for tuning in. New subscribers, welcome. Those that continue on, always great to have you here. Um, and let's continue to expand our community. You know, one thing I love is um, many times I'll get a thing from Johnny. Um, I do love Johnny. Isn't he great? But many times it say that I was doing the reading on Limbaugh. What was it? Limbaugh the other day. He said he was pulling the cards with me and it got exactly the same thing with Limbaugh. And that's happened with us many times. He'll, he'll contact me and say, you're doing the reading and I was doing the same and I got the same thing, you know. So we're usually pretty in sync with our readings. Um, also, Jen Lynn. I'm so looking forward to doing some more things with them, the readings. Right now, though, I've got to go turn down my heater because I'm about to get run out of here. The, the temperature is starting to warm up, and i got to open the window and let some of this heat out. <laughs> cold outside, not cold in here at the moment. It's, it's getting way warm, so I'm going to go adjust that, and I'll see you online. Thanks for tuning in.